How's it going, guys? This is Omega again. And as you can see, the world is not as we left it because I decided that I wanted to add a new mod to my version of the Moon Quest pack that is the Dimensional Doors mod for a little bit of extra adventure. And once I actually do get to the moon or wherever, a way to quick travel. Let's kind of make sure that it's actually working. And yes, it is. And now there is a gold dimensional door. That's new since I last played. Okay. Anyway, we are as I just pretty much said, and as was going to be the case anyway because of how things went so badly in the first session, well, first episode, which amounted to a full session, uh, basically starting over again from complete scratch. We left off, I had a little bit of sugar cane and a couple of flowers that had caused some curiosity, but that's all gone, but that wasn't anything really important anyway, so no big. Not too fussed about it. Here we are in a brand new world, and we're going back to the basics once more. Hope you guys are having a great Christmas holiday, Christmas season so far. Just had our first snowfall, first uh, major snowfall of the year yesterday, where I'm at. And... It's... While I'm no huge fan of snow because of the cold weather that it brings with it, it was actually pretty nice to see. more blocks than I thought there was going to be in this tree. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to need to pillar up a bit. I think I have a new Christmas wish for uh, Martin in the Little Woods Christmas adventure now. That being, I wish I knew someone to play this mod pack with, recording or otherwise. Someone who had a server because I can't exactly host and play from my computer, and I can't, like, um, can't really afford to rent a server right at now. Okay. On a less almost sounding like begging note, which was not, but I can see it might be taken that way. Uh, apologize for the absence, I've had a busy few days, and, well, didn't really have a chance to do much gaming let alone record any of it. You know that I don't really have that big of an audience at this stage, so not too many people are probably too fussed about that, but 
felt like it was right to say something anyway. Huh. That's a nice hat, sheep. Each for hats. Ah, uh, just occurs to me, I completely forgot. I was planning just before launching this and starting my recording, planning to sort of Christmas up my avatar a bit, but completely slipped my mind until just now when I saw myself in the hats menu. <clears throat> oh, palm trees. That's a new one. Haven't... well, I assume it's not so much new as just I haven't seen it. Uh, I need to make myself one of these and use it to make some basic tools. Okay. So how's everyone doing? Hope you're having a great week so far. I know I'm having an all right week. Um, Yogg's Cast Christmas live stream has been going on. I've been missing out on a lot of that because of the whole being busy thing, but actually got to see uh, the the first half of the well, first little bit of the Blackrock live stream today. Um, a little bit of messing about in Caber Town. The for those of you who don't watch the Ogscast, uh, that's gonna be a confusing reference. But for anyone who does, well, you know what I'm talking about. And a little bit of. That bunch, that group, playing Starbound. Which looks like a really interesting game. I definitely need to try to get the money together to pick that up, and I don't know what the what Chucklefish's stance on recording is, but if I can get my hands on the game and look into it and I find out that they're kind of lenient on it, then... You may be seeing a little bit of Starbound footage from me. And... let's see... Oh, I actually did pick up a couple saplings of that. Okay... Now, there's a couple more. Hmm. Right now, let's... Get stuck in, do a little bit of mining. Oh. What do you know? I was just gonna make some charcoal, but I found a nice coal deposit right off the bat. Really nice coal deposit. So, for those of you who may not be too familiar with me, my method, I kind of have anxiety issues, so I'm a little bit quiet when I'm recording, but I'm doing, I'm trying to get over that, which is why I started recording in the first place. Uh, and it's actually been helping, not 
massively much, as you can probably tell, but enough that I am actually a lot less nervous and, like, uh, quiet than I would have been a, lo a while back. And hopefully the whole quiet thing doesn't put anybody off. It's just part of who I am. At least for the time being, I'm working on, like, becoming a little bit less of the quiet guy. Um, it's just taking some time because doing things where I have to deal with anxiety-inducing situations is basically what I do to get past it, so while it does work, it's not the fastest method. Right. Ow! Are you serious? What is that zombie wearing? Okay, I don't want to eat the zombie flesh, but... Okay, I've got enough cobblestone for... Oh, are you serious? I broke my torch. Damn! It got in. Hmm. A lapis lazuli helmet? Okay, where did I put my... Crafting table. There it is. Oh, let's. Oh God. Okay, just really. Okay. Where was I? I think... Oh, I'm underwater right now. Okay, I was in this general direction. I think... Don't see any blips of light on the mini... On the, oh! This is having... Quite the... Uh... Ow. Similar start to my last episode. Okay, I have no idea where I was when I died. Oh, there's some light. I think that must be where I was. Let's see if I can get there without dying. And before my stuff despawns. Almost there now. Oh, are you serious? Okay, there's no way I'm getting there at all now. Wait. That 
might have been a fortunate death. I just hope my stuff doesn't despawn before I get back. And that I can actually find a way back that doesn't involve going past... Is that a creeper riding a spider, or is that just the hissing hat? Oh, that's terrifying. That's an actual spider riding creeper. I might be out of luck. I have no idea how much time has passed since my first death, so I don't know if my stuff's even still there. Judging from the moon's position, it's still very risky to be out. But on the plus side, at least I've almost found where I was, or I found where I was and almost back to it. And it's Guarded by creepers. Wonderful. And tiny spiders. Ah. Ow. Oh, great. Eh, this is fun. And for some reason, I can't seem to swim. Okay, there we go. Moon's going down. That may be a bad thing in terms of my stuff. Whether it'll be there when I get there or not. But it's a good thing in terms of anything that's not spiders or creepers being around. By which I mean not being around. Ow. This is perfect. Okay, I actually spawned somewhere that's not in the water this time, and the sun's coming up. This actually is perfect, unless my stuff despawns before I get there, but even then, it's better than what has been going on. And that's a skeleton and a creeper. Bones to the left of me, creepers to the right. Here I am, stuck in the middle with you. I think I'm almost back. Once again, I don't know if... Uh, if my stuff is going to survive all those deaths of me. And now, 
because it's... Oh, wait, there's the... Ow. The palm tree area, I think. Yep. Perfect. Here is hoping that at least some of... Oh, look at that. Some of my stuff survived. Put that back on, even though it's almost broken. Pink hibiscus flower. Still got... My oak planks. My, and my cobble despawned, but... I can chop down a couple more trees and make a pick. Let's... Okay, I've got 20 minutes already on this recording, but this time things are actually going not great, but a lot better than episode one. Let's see if any more of my stuff survived and it looks like eh, computer says no all right in that case i will do this for my safety uh, light up over here a bit. Back here. And we'll call this home for now. And I'm going to call quits on this recording session. I've already gone over my self prescribed 20 minute limit. Hopefully, you all enjoyed. Leave a like, comment, subscribe if you did. Let me know if anyone else is playing with this uh, MoonQuest Reloaded pack or just uh, any kind of pack that involves a, a what do you call it, um, Galacticraft, and I will see you next time.